Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Love for Haitian Food. I am your host, Mani Sherry. Mani Sherry. If this is your first time here, welcome. Please like, share this video, and subscribe to my channel if you like what you see here. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make spaghetti ag jonjon, which is spaghetti with black mushrooms. Actually, I'm using linguine for this recipe, but I think it sounds smoother when you say spaghetti ag jonjon. But anyway, I'm using shrimp with it. I'm making it with shrimp. It's really good, and if you wanna see how I make it, stay tuned. To make this, you will need linguine, black mushrooms, jonjon, bell peppers, onions, garlic, epis, or green seasoning, dried thyme, clove powder, bouillon cube, hot pepper, cooking margin. And for the shrimp, you're gonna need, of course, your shrimp, all-purpose seasoning, salt, and oil. First thing I'm gonna do is prepare the jonjon. I wanna boil it and extract the flavor and the color. That's how the spaghetti, or not spaghetti, but the linguine is gonna get that nice color. But before you do that, you wanna look through it and make sure that it doesn't have any funky things in it because sometimes it might have like rocks and leaves. So you just wanna go through it and me, really anything that don't look right to me, I'm taking it out. Like, I don't know what this is. I'm taking that out. This kinda look a little funky, so I'm taking it out. And then you just wanna do that, just go through it and remove all the bad stuff that don't look right. And then, so once you do that, you could go ahead, add it to your pot. My grandmother was telling me that my aunt, she sees my aunt roast the jonjon before she adds the water, like just to toast it a little bit. So that's what I'm gonna do. She said it helps it get the flavor more intense and darker color. So that's what we are going to try. I'm gonna put my fire on high and I'm just gonna let it toast a little bit. Anything that look crazy, take it out. All right, so I'm gonna let that heat up and we're gonna do that for about five minutes. Less. As you can see, I still saw some funky looking things in there even after I put it in the pot and that's what I'm taking out here. Like already I could smell the mushroom. As you can see, it's like smoking a little bit. So you just want to toss it around. So you just want to do this until it's fragrant and then I am going to add my water to it. I add the water. So all of the ingredients and the instructions are gonna be on the website. So this is about seven cups of water added to this. Now I'm gonna let this come to a boil. And when it's done boiling, I am going to strain it. And then we're gonna use the water. While that's boiling, I'm gonna marinate my scramps. So the shrimp that I have here is already cleaned. If you wanna see how to clean shrimp, I have a really good video. Just click the card above or check the description box for the link. I show you thoroughly how to clean the shrimp. But yeah, I was not about cleaning shrimp, so I just bought it cleaned and it saved me so much time. Like all I had to do was remove the vein from the, the bottom part of the shrimp, like the under part of it. Now that I have my jonjon boiling, I am going to season my shrimp. I'm gonna add it to a bigger bowl so I could have more space. I have my all-purpose seasoning here and my salt. I'm gonna give it a shake and shake to mix it up. So if you don't have my all-purpose seasoning mix, I am going to add um, alternative spices that you could use on the website, of course. Yeah, the all-purpose seasoning is pretty good, so you should try it. It's low sodium, that's why I have to add some extra salt to this. So just gonna sprinkle that on this here. Get all of that on it and then mix. 
get it well coated with that seasoning. Mm, mm, mm. And it smells so good. And my shrimp, my people who can't eat shrimp, I'm sorry. You can make this with chicken. Yes, you can. The same way that I'm doing it with the shrimp, you could do that. Um, or you could just make it without the shrimp or without any meat. Make it vegan. So that looks good right there. I'm gonna let that sit. Now that my jonjon is done boiling, I am going to strain it and keep the water because that's what we want from it. We want the water. Okay. So I could already see that this is not gonna be enough liquid because most of it, not most of it, but some of it evaporated while it was boiling. So I'm gonna add two more cups. And remember, originally I had seven cups in there. So I'm gonna add two more cups. And all of this is gonna be explained on the website, so don't worry about that. So I'm just gonna press out the liquid. Okay, and we're finished with this, so you could just discard it. So I'm gonna add the jojon liquid back to the pot and let it come to a boil. Once it starts boiling, I'm gonna add my salt and I'm gonna add my pasta. Now that my jojon liquid is boiling, I'm gonna add my salt. And now I'm gonna add the pasta to the liquid. Usually I break my pasta in half, but I don't anymore. If you break it too, don't. You wanna leave it whole cause it makes your finished dish look more appealing. You'll see what I mean when I show you the close up. So the pasta is cooked and now I'm gonna strain it and I'm not gonna get rid of that of the liquid. I'm gonna put two cups of the liquid aside for later use. On low to medium heat, I'm gonna add half of my oil and I'm gonna add the shrimp and I'm gonna cook it for about two minutes on each side. Guys, do you like this video? If you do, please give me a big thumbs up and share it with your people. It really helps the channel out when you do that. Thank you in advance. So I'm gonna let my shrimp fry for about two minutes and now I'm gonna turn it over and let it fry again for another two minutes on the other side. Okay, I'm gonna start flipping them over now. So the shrimp is done. I am gonna take it out because we don't want it to overcook. All right, now I'm gonna add the rest of the oil. I'm gonna add my ipis, my green seasoning. Next, I'm gonna add my onions, bell peppers, saute all of that in there, and then my garlic, next I'm gonna add my bouillon cube. I'm using a vegetable one, but you can use whatever you like. Remember I told you to reserve some of that jonjon liquid from earlier. To that, I am going to add my hot pepper, my clove powder, dry thyme, Add a little mixy mix. And now I am going to add my pasta. Yeah, when you're making this, try to move 
fast. Don't let the pasta sit. So you wanna mix all of that together. See how beautiful that color is. And now I am going to add my cooking margarine. So at this point, if you wanna add your shrimp back in, you can. And just reserve a few of them so you could plate it nicely on top add the rest and i'm going to also add the juice from the the shrimp back in there give it a nice toss now is my favorite time time to taste Now guys, if you haven't tried pasta with Jojo, try it. Delicious. And try the shrimp. Mm. Mm. L'el bon, for d'il bon, li bon. I hope you guys try. I like this recipe. Bye. Music is My Wife by King Flunts. Thank you for watching. Bye. Follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and Pinterest. Subscribe to my channel and watch some of my previous videos while you're here. Thank you.